Hello everyone, here we are again for another session of Seller's Choice Tutorials. In this tutorial, we will learn how to set up your sales tax rates in Shopify. There are really times when where we need to charge taxes. Sometimes we need to report and remit those taxes to your government. Though we don't see it right away, we are benefiting from it. Although tax laws and regulations are complex and can change often, you can set up Shopify to automatically handle the most common sales tax calculation. You can also set up tax overrides to address unique tax laws and situations. Please be advised that Shopify doesn't file or remit your sales taxes for you. You may need to have your business registered with your local or federal tax authority to handle your sales tax. What you can do with Shopify is that you can use their calculations and reports that it provides, which makes it easier. You should always check with the local tax authority or tax accountant to make sure that you charge your customers the correct sales tax rates and to make sure that you file and remit the taxes correctly. So let's get started. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. Access your Shopify admin. Visit www.shopify.com. Once you're in, click the settings located on the bottom left of the Shopify admin and select Taxes on the grid. You should reach the Taxes page. This is where you can freely change your taxes rates. On the tax settings section, there are two checkboxes. First one is to apply taxes to all of your prices. The second one is if you wanted to apply taxes in your shipping rates. Just click the save button to finalize your setting. Tax rate section is where you can freely set up your tax rates. Click the rest of the world link to access the country tax. Change and set your flat percentage rate for your country tax. This is if you are shipping outside of the United States. Once you set your rates and save the changes, a pop-up will appear at the bottom for the confirmation and changes will be applied right away. You can also add a tax override. This is if you wanted to add a customized region-based tax rates for specific product collections. Just click the Add a Tax Override link on the left. Choose between Products and Shipping, select a collection or create one, set your tax rate, and click the Add Override button. You should see your created override on the list right away. If you wanted to delete the override, just hover your mouse to it and click the trash icon on the right. Then click delete button to confirm. To set up customized shipping here in the United States, click the United States link in the taxes rate section. If you wanted to make your life easier, Put a check on the Calculate Taxes automatically and Shopify will do the computation for you. It changes accordingly if there's an update or change with the tax rates. If you want to customize it, then uncheck the automation and set your tax rate for each state. Label the type of tax and choose the setup that you want it to have. Once you're done with any changes, don't forget to click the save button. So that's it. Those are the things that you need to know about setting up your sales tax rates in Shopify. Just so you know that we have a lot of tutorials and webinars on bits of advice on how to run and the applicable techniques for your e-commerce business. You can always visit our site at sellerschoice.agency and browse through our huge compilations of webinars, tutorials, and blogs. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button to stay tuned. See you soon!